You're not going to hear this one on any of the mainstream news. So please, donate, subscribe. Patrick Gossage. He is 85 years old. He was a press secretary to Pierre Elliott Trudeau. And then he's in our embassy in Washington. He knows politics. He knows liberal politics. And he's written a blog. And I read it and I saw it. And I'm astonished at what you're saying. Tell our audience about it. Well, what I'm basically saying is Canada is in a horrible mess and is going to stay in a mess for the next for the next, I would say, four or five years. And there's, and there's so many things wrong with Canada, not the least of which is its politics. Uh, it's politics, it's economy, and there, and there are no easy cures. No easy cures. I mean, you know, um, Paul Vieira says, ax the tax. Well, he can do that, you know, which will put yep. us... Which will help individuals. Pardon? It'll help people pay yeah, for no, things. It's, it's probably the one thing that he can do that'll be done quickly and that'll have an, a really, and that people will really like. But then it's build the homes, bullshit. Excuse me. Homes aren't getting built. There's, there are less new homes being built now than ever before. Part of that is municipal government messing it up. I know, but, I'm uh, in that you know, but it's just, it ain't happening, man. Yep. There isn't any incentive for private builders to build homes now. So that can be provided for by well, the government. Well, That's not there now. Yeah, but you know what? Polivier is not going to build the, what's really needed is affordable homes. And that, the government has to build affordable homes themselves. And there's no way he's going to get into that. No way. Anyway, and then he says, fix the budget. Well, um, I, it's, you know, the budget is what it is. And, I, I, you know, it's going to be, we're in a huge deficit. And that ain't going away anytime soon. But it has to be cut. I mean, somebody has to address that. Unlike Trudeau saying it fixes itself. One of the reasons why you have such economic bad problems because we have such low productivity, so we have such high inflation yeah. because people can't pay the bills, is that deficit and all the money we're paying to the uh, yeah, money no, grabbers. No, 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 and I mean, but cutting government is going to, going to mean cutting a lot, of the, a lot of the programs that actually help people. But is it not, not and, the and, you part know, of leadership, I, Patrick, to cut the stuff that is useful and good and helpful to people and keep that and cut the garbage, and a lot of garbage that Trudeau has created well, with his 100,000 yeah, some servants. Anyway, I mean, the fact is, is that what Trudeau, the, what Trudeau's laid down in, ter in terms of, in terms of uh, the child tax credit, for instance, he would not dare take that away. And Correct. that's a huge item. Yep. Is he going to take away, uh, you know, the dental care plan? I don't think so. There, there's almost a million old people now going to have their teeth fixed that they never had before. And PharmaCare probably will go, but anyway, it's not hitting the budget anytime soon. But I think the other thing that really disturbs me is the, is the Trumpification of our politics. That there, there is, is a time, Patrick. It's I'm not going, going to change. It's going to get worse. I'm going to this is going to be the Patrick, worst. Patrick, I'm going to interrupt you. That's for another show. You know this is three minutes, Patrick Gossage. Thank okay. you. Three minutes. <laughs> to those of you who have subscribed and donated, a heartfelt thank you. You're keeping us on the air. If you're watching and you haven't, please try to do so. Because four years ago, we started this show because there needed to be independent analysis. Now more than ever, with the Online Harms Act, once that gets into law, it's been passed once by the House, there are going to be hundreds of bureaucrats censoring the news in Canada, censoring this show. We need to keep it on the air. Thanks for your support.